In today's news, CNBC just dropped a major announcement regarding JP Morgan. It seems that the time has finally come and it's only up from here. JP Morgan thinks that the worst of the ETF selling pressure on Bitcoin might be over. In a research note on Thursday, the investment bank said that investors taking profits from the conversion of the Grayscale Bitcoin Trust has likely been a driver of Bitcoin's recent correction. JPM estimated that of the $4.3 billion that's exited GBTC, about $3 billion can be linked to profit taking. Now the other $1.3 billion, potentially investors moving into cheaper ETFs. The bank thinks that with most of the profit taking out of the way, that grayscale driven pressure on Bitcoin will ease. Also, as for which cheaper ETFs investors could be moving to, JP Morgan sees two competitors to grayscale emerging, BlackRock and Fidelity. Both have much lower fees. This is a very big deal, therefore implying that from this point forward, we shouldn't see less than a $39,000, $40,000 Bitcoin and the crypto market for the most part should stabilize, leading into the biggest run up in crypto history. Now moving on, our next major headline continues to surround JP Morgan. In this clip here from XRP Drops, we can see the CEO Jamie Dimon state in this interview, the rich should be taxed more to help the poor. We have today. That, that population, the lower income folks, have more crime, worse health, uh, less good schools, and we can talk about that a little bit too. This is like a no-brainer, lift up society. And I would pay for it by taxing the wealthy a little bit more. Now, personally, I find this clip very hypocritical, considering the majority of the 1% elites purposefully avoid paying tax as it is already making them part of the problem. And in rebuttal to his claim about, quote, low income folks have more crime. Where this may be true, again, the wealthy are no saints and their crimes are arguably more severe as over the last 23 years, JP Morgan has been fined $39 billion for fraud, money laundering and market manipulation. And this is precisely why we need cryptocurrency to bring transparency into the financial industry. We have assets like Ripple with XRP that are spearheading this new monetary shift and we can see from this document here that Ripple are combating money laundering through compliance and crypto. And it's these sort of developments that will allow Ripple and XRP to soar to the moon. Thanks for watching, please like, share, subscribe, speak, good day and good night.